key pieces of apparel for women is their sports bra. It's a lot of women that we talk to, there's two things that they can't run without, and that's their shoes and their sports bra. Women come in all different shapes and sizes, but we really um, looked at ways that we could customize um, the fit for each runner and really lent itself to coming up with different innovative solutions. The three um, challenges that we wanted to address um, in designing these bras was, the first was support, um, the second was moisture management, and the third is the adjustability. When you embark on a project like this, it requires to do a ton of testing. Part of our testing was biomechanical lab testing, 3D testing on a treadmill with live candidates. They place eight sensors on tester. What we're testing for is the static movement in between the top sensors and the bottom sensors to identify how much breast movement the runner is actually experiencing. We know that we need to reduce the amount of movement. Let me just show you a little bit about how the inside of the bra was constructed. And there's a few things going on here. The first is we have a 3D molded cup and what I mean by molding is that they actually use heat pressure to shape the fabric that simulates you know, the shape of a breast. So what that does is it encapsulates the breast tissue, which actually we found is better um, to immobilize you know, movement rather than what a lot of women, you know, when they buy bras, they wanna just compress them down. And actually we found if you encapsulate the breast rather than compressing it, it provides better support. So that's, that's what encapsulated um, bra cups do. The key features um, on the U-back is that um, it has a fully adjustable back closure. What we heard from consumers is that along with you know, the support when it's on, they need to be able to actually get it on. So what that enables um, a female runner to do is, is really easily just put it on and they don't have to try and pull it over their head. Key feature is, are these adjustable straps and we've used a really nice soft um, Velcro backing um, that's against your skin that creates a little bit of a pad because we know that um, for a larger busted women, a lot of times the straps, they dig in. A lot of women are really different um, in their height between their shoulder and their bust. So this allows that customized fit. Another key feature on the bra is um, we've paid, paid really special attention to the way the bottom band is constructed. On the inside, it's very flat, um, creating you know, a really nice surface that is not gonna chafe because that's a really high chafe area for a lot of women. The other thing that we did was really paid special attention to the way that the materials are zoned. We've actually introduced a, a stretch woven that's in the bottom band and on the side panels. And what that does is it really locks out the material so that um, you don't have a lot of movement going on in the front chest band and then on the lateral sides of the bra. It was really critical for us to use dry fit materials and lightweight materials that would wick moisture really quickly around this bottom band area and in the center chest. The second bra that we're introducing for Fall 10 is what we're calling our um, x back It's more of a traditional style pullover bra for that runner that prefers to have that racer back style that they're more comfortable with. What it has is this really nice racer back style that has a cutout for a little bit of an extra um, feature for ventilation. It's got the same great features as the U-back with an adjustable strap. All the same great fabrics in terms of zoning for support are built in with the chest band, the side wings that are built into the internal bra, the molded cups, it has all the same great features. Women are really sensitive to how they're shaped, you know, by the bras that they wear. And this bra definitely enhances and it definitely, you know, makes you look nice.